All right. Uh, introductions, as usual. Yeah. All right. Uh, hello, everybody. This is episode what? Two? Three? Not two. Three. Three? We did three because we did Mickey three. and then we did Little Nemo. Yeah. All right. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Can We Beat This? Episode 3. Uh, it's been quite a while since we had some time to actually do this. It has. But um, Ben and I were going through my collection, and we couldn't figure out what game to try to beat because we tried to choose games that we can beat in one sitting. Until I found um, this beauty in my collection. This is Deja Vu. It is from ICOM Simulations. It is one of those games that was originally on the computer, and then it was ported to the Nintendo, and you'll see it has a complete computer interface, which does not work well with a Nintendo controller, but we get by. Uh, if you watch my WTF videos, I did a video based on the icon, what I call the ICOM Trilogy. There are three games that use the same interface, and those are uh, Shadowgate, uh, Deja Vu, and the uninvited. Now I beat the uninvited, but but this was my first one, and it's a mystery game about a detective who has amnesia. You gotta find out who set you up for murder, get rid of all the evidence against you, and then go to the cops. I have been able to figure everything out except what evidence to get rid of. So. This is a tough one. I've been wanting to beat this game. It was like that Disney one we did. I always wanted to beat this. But I never have. So hopefully with our combined <laughs> powers, we can beat Deja Vu. Okay. All right. Never well, heard of this before, though. Oh, you're going to love the interface. It's going to drive you crazy. All right, go ahead. Push start. File one. What? The typewriter thing. It's a bullet. Yeah, but I don't know. Now what's cool is if you play the other games, the um, the icon's different. I think an uninvited is a hand on the bottom or a skull or something, and then Shadowgate it's something to do with magic. I think it's like a wand. So each game has this cool little Icon. Are you scrolling too fast? People might not be able to read this. Well, I read it. Uh, well, I know you could. I read it too. Uh. But what about our poor audience? I figure if I could read it, they could read it. Okay. <laughs> then you realize you can't remember who you are! You have no idea where you are and why you are here. So let me ask you, Ben, what... Judging from the, the, the room you're in, where are you? Well, I'd say a bathroom. There's some toilet paper and a place to hang your coat. So okay. I, that's how my bathroom looks. Your bathroom's a stall? Eh, it's not big. Okay. I've never been to your house, so I don't know. All right, now, as you can see, this is made for the PC. Like, you're supposed to have a mouse. I like how you think the light is beautiful. Yeah. Can't remember my name, but that's a beautiful light. <laughs> now, what makes this game a little tedious is, okay, so you see your coat there, right? Yeah. a coat. What do you think it is? Uh, I think it's a light brown trench coat that matches my trousers. There you go. Alright, now check this out. So you feel something in the pocket of the coat, right? Mm -hmm. Now, how do you get the item out of the pocket? Oh, uh, well, I mean, I've played games like this before, so I mean, like, take, I guess. 
Well, you took the cup now. Okay. Do I have the cup? And a 38 special. Take that. Alright, now, now just for giggles, go to use. Actually, go to save first. Yes. Okay, now use gun. On self. Yeah, see down there it says self under your notes. Well, I probably don't have any dreams or aspirations if I can't remember anything. Hey, what happened? Blam happened. <laughs> but now I know my name, right? You are Ace Hardy. Yeah, I know my name. Problem solved. Now, well, you see, what makes this game, these games so fun is the fact that you can die in such... Like, like in the Uninvited, you can actually die from being melted by acid. And they describe it. And it's amazing. So do I go continue then? Yeah, hit continue. To get the stuff out of your coat, you have to open it. Now you don't need to take that stuff out, you just remember that you have it in your coat. You know what I mean? Okay. So, uh, coins are obvious, a lighter, again, obvious, gum, uh, open wallet. Oh. No, you can't open your sunglasses. Yeah, I didn't hit down enough. Take those out because you don't want to open everything constantly just to get back to them. I've always liked the music to this game. Alright. There you go. Now you can close your wallet. Um, on the notebook thing, where it has the, the pages go right. There you go. Oh, I guess you don't need to close it then. Oh, yeah. And he's very complicated. Yeah. I think I need to take that toilet paper, though. <laughs> I don't think you can. Why not? It's one of those ones that are bolted. It doesn't look like it. I am sorry. Can I just unravel the whole thing and stick it in my wallet or something? <laughs> no! Why would you do that? I might need it. You don't need... Get out of the damn bathroom. I'm trying to take the light bulb. You can't take the light bulb then. But after I figure out who I am, I'll get a house and I want that beautiful light. It's... Trying to open up the medicine cabinet. It's not a medicine cabinet. It's obviously just a mirror. It looks like a medicine cabinet. I, I know it does. Alright. Dramatic music. <laughs> Is that a beautiful light?
You can fast forward the text. Punch the mirror. That's a strong mirror. I know there's a mirror you actually can it's, shatter. It's already cracked a little bit too and you still couldn't break it. You kind of suck. Alright, let's keep, let's keep going forward. But forward is where I came from, right? No, 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 you went back. Now you're going forward. Uh, you should be able to figure that out. <laughs> Very basic. It's a very basic game. All right. If you look, um, if you look on the bottom where it says move, that's your map. The bottom square is the room you came from, and the other squares are rooms you could go into. Okay. So if you're ever confused by the layout, that's how you figure it out. But remember, you have to open doors. You can't just walk into them. I'll just open all the doors right now. There you go. Now, is it me or does that other room look like it's flooded because you have that blue streak on the wall? I want to take the water. <sighs> what? Why would you take the water? I'm thirsty. I think you can get. I think you can actually get whiskey somewhere. Maybe you could break that mirror. Check the trash can. Open wastebasket. Better not be tampons. Waste bucket. Waste, waste bucket. Well, that's just a waste of our time. Yep. Next door. Is that a door? That's a door. Huh. This is where we came That's from? That's where we came from. Okay. So... Can I open this now? Nope. You're pissing the game off. Oh, push B. Push B to cancel your thing. There you go. Now just click on the open door. There you go. Okay, that's easy. Hmm. Open the back of the toilet. <laughs> uh, use toilet. Really? Uh, I have no idea. Well, if I can't do that there, where <laughs> can I do it? I guess there's nothing here. I want to take it. You can't take it. Excuse me. Don't. Really? <laughs> Numb from hitting toilet paper. Yes, dude, you're a weakling. All right. You have amnesia and muscle, what's that word, dystrophy? <laughs> so how do I just go All back? Right, go, hit move. Time. Yeah, cancel with B. Well, now you just punched your map. Right, cancel. Now click on it. Dick, specific game. All right, move and click on it. The game's like, no, you got to tell me what you want. Yeah. Jones bar. Um, <sighs> take it. I remember you need seltzer for something. Well, there's no like inventory limit, so you can just take whatever the hell you want. Okay. So you can just carry around shot glasses of seltzer and you won't drop it or... No, it won't spill or anything. Uh, examine the key you have and the card.
Alright, so that's for upstairs. What's the card? Oh, it's a, um... For a penthouse. Yeah. Alright. Now you got three places to go. I think the front door to the bar is locked. Then you have the cellar, and then you have the upstairs. So this is the front door here. That's right? the front door. And then that looks like another front That's door. That's the cellar. But it's going right next to the window. That's it's outside. the cellar. It makes sense! Okay. Go upstairs. You feel like you have been up for many days. I don't. <laughs> Ugh, hit me sleep. Now that's how I feel right now. How many hours of sleep did you get? Oh, uh, like three or four. Jesus, I only got like five. This is like my normal amount of sleep. Some time. I think if you exam, exam, yeah, yeah. yeah. Doghouse Riley. What? Oh, shoot. Um. Sorry, technical difficulties, everyone. Oh. Alright, might as well need to go to Best Buy and get rid of all this crap. All this electrical junk I need to throw away. See, Doghouse Riley was so frightening, it glitched everything. Are you back up? Yeah. Right, cool. P Puff McMuffin. <laughs> It's me. Yeah, we learned that from the um, gravestone. After, after I we... shot myself. <laughs> I don't re Can you imagine that? I don't remember who I am. Only well, uh, one thing to do. It's. It, what did you think it was? Um. Now you see, that doesn't look like a typewriter to me. No. It looks like a scroll, like for a declaration. And that's a lamp. Open the desk. Open the envelope. Take the bill. You got the key, the office key. Yeah, other way. Address. What's address? I don't remember address. Oh, you get addresses later in the game. Oh. And you use a taxi cab to go to places. So, uh, key one. Do, do people drink seltzer? I thought clowns sprayed it at people. But what's the purpose of this? I know you use it for medicine, right? Uh, you mix it with certain drinks, I think? I don't know. I'm not a drinker. Well, if you know what seltzer's used for, please leave a comment below. <laughs> I don't know. The main use, I think, is for clowns to shoot out of flowers. <laughs> so, you mean seltzer was completely made just for clowns? I think so. Ben, what did you do? Uh, I think I killed a guy. Well, everything here just went to turn for the worst. Well, should I just call the police? N no! But, I i mean, I just woke up. They won't believe you. They're the police. The po no. How much you want to bet it, that your gun is what killed the man? 
Oh no. <laughs> Smart ass. Uh, open his pocket. Open the corpse. <laughs> Scab knife. Ah! Alright, take the next key. I love this music. It's all dramatic. Open the window blinds. Now jump out the window! Yeah. It's a fire escape. Use it to escape from a fire. Uh, <laughs> Alright, if you move right, that brings you back in the office. I don't know what happens if you move up or down. I think down brings you to the alley. Yeah, up brings to the third floor. Go in the window. You, know, you are a dumb detective. Am I a detective, though? I'm guessing you are. Oh my god. God, it's like my bedroom. I mean, it's like, it's, um... Oh, it took me a while to realize what that was. What, the chair? Yeah. I know, it's not very well drawn, is it? Yeah, it's like this... It's like, okay, there's a snake, and then... Yeah, it's, it's very weird drawn. Okay, now, this room... Examine the pill bottles... Sodium pentothal. You know what? Now that I'm an adult, I know what that is. That's truth serum. Yep. Med resin. Do you know what that is? Uh, well, things that end in that are like, uh... I can't think of the word. Alright, I'll try the next one. It's gonna bother me. Diathon trimene. Oh, oh, that sounds so familiar. Doesn't it? Kinda. Ah, dick. Uh, don't Google it. I'll Google it. Why can't I Google it? I thought you Google it. But I like Google. Fine, Google it! Give me the controller. Well, okay, how do you pronounce it? Di... trimene. What does diethanol try mean? I would be so impressed if your phone could figure that out. I, I think it can. <laughs> look, look, look. Even the computer, <laughs> even the game is like, it sounds familiar. Well, I want to take the drugs. Oh, no, it, it did not. No? Yeah. Alright. So, we have the, um, the mezzanine one, this one. Medrazine. Medrazine. Medrazine? We took that. Alright. I'm going to examine the wastebasket because I remember there's something here. How do you open an open wastebasket? Okay, why shouldn't I uh, shouldn't, uh, Google that? Why? Did you get images? Um. Well, I don't think it's a real chemical. Okay, so what'd you get? It, it came up with, like, sort of a spoiler for the game. Ah! Are you serious? Yeah. That's awesome. Alright, well, I want to take these drug capsules. Alright, so I got the medazine and the drug capsules. And... What's this? What do you think you're doing? I'm opening the effing door. Oh, God, you're so tedious. Oh, it's an elevator button. Hit. That should work, right? Well, if you punch it. Hey, it worked! I punched the elevator. Okay, um... What's floor? Actually, while I'm here, I want to examine... 
key to Mercedes Benz. Okay. Nice. You got a car. I do have a car. It's a nice one too. All right. Which floor? Uh, fourth floor. Fourth down. You mean? No, the fourth. We're top. on the fourth floor. I thought we we're on the third. All right. That's right. Yeah. Uh. You know this game's a smart ass. So the second floor is my office. First floor is the bar. Why does an elevator go to there? I think we're in a shady elevator. Yeah, I don't want to go in the sewer yet, so... I guess it's like a maze. I'm opening the manhole, you prick. I don't think it, you can. I think it's open or something. Oh. <laughs> so. Take the spider. No. It might kill us. Oh, there's no spider. That's a clue. Why is the spider gone? You know what? I want to doubt if it's a joke towards uninvited, because in that game you actually have to punt, you have to kidnap a spider. <laughs> okay, uh... Open the barrel and drink it. Why is there a casino, like... You go into the sewer, you come out <laughs> in a casino. All right, now let's save this. I think that there's no way to lose, but if I remember correctly, you got to use your coins on the slot machine. Because you need to get more coins for the taxi cab. What do you mean I can't use... Oh my god. You can't use them. You haven't taken dirt to dirt. It's in your coat and you're like, I can't use these <laughs> coins. I can't use what's in my coat. Wait, so what's that bill? Can you examine the bill? I will examine. Can I put the code on? Because the other one says twenty dollar bill, which is obvious. The other one just says bill. Is it like a bill? Like I think it's like services. A, yeah, it's a bill from Doctor Brody's. Hey, we got an address. We're in Chicago. This is the prequel to Watch Dogs. There you go. Ah, look, look. Looks like I purchased the stuff. You can buy sodium pentothal for like fifty six dollars. Yeah, didn't you know that? No, it's crazy. No, I, I buy it all the time. I, I just like dipping it, you know, I put in people's drinks and watch them share all their secrets. Alright. One more. One more. That was easy. Now we should have enough for the taxi cab. Alright, so... Oh. He went the hard way. I guess. So you're in Chicago, there's a bar, and then there's a casino <laughs> under the bar. Right. So, uh, yeah, so the way this works is we're in a bar. The second floor is my office. Ugh. The third floor is... Ugh, God dang it. Wait, the, wait, so the elevator... Third floor is dead guy. Fourth floor is where... 
the bondage chair is. Right. And apparently I cannot go into the floor of an elevator in my office. Maybe I can't use it. It's a safe. You can't use the safe. I'll open it. Uh, you need the combination. All right, you already looked in the guy's wallet, right? Uh, well, his jacket. His jacket, okay. There's just the key in there. Okay. Okay, I can't open that. Well, the phone line's cut. Well, I want it. It's a pay phone. That phone's not cut. Alright, so if that, then what's this? It should go down to the casino area, right? Okay, now this is weird. This is a glitch. No, it's not. Why is it a glitch? Oh, you know what? It's because we went through the. Alright, look, if you went through this room without going from the casino to this room, there would be a wine rack right here. And you have to punch a specific wine bottle to open that up. But since we went the other way, it opened automatically. You oh. know what I'm saying? Okay. Alright, so... The door won't open. It must be locked. Jump through the window. I think it could shoot the window. Don't shoot the window. That's, that's unnecessary. What was key to... Two. Uh, Mercedes. That's right. You know what? We can't go through the front door. We have to go through the sewers. We gotta go through the sewers. I remember this now. And we gotta hope there's no crocodile. There's no crocodiles there. No, there is. It's actually one of the ways you can get a game over. In Chicago. Yeah. I'm not messing a with A crocodile. You. Yes. I'm pretty sure even, like, where there are crocodiles, they don't just hang out in the sewers. No, they do. If you wander the sewer too much, a crocodile shows up and you have to shoot it. Okay. He wants all of your money. Ugh. Why don't you give him a bullet in the face? You won't be able to. Well, you can punch him in the face. Now you can only do this to him three times, and then he will shoot you. Why can't you shoot him? Because you're, apparently you're too slow. Okay. But you now. can punch him. Yes, you can punch him. Ben, stop putting logic in this. There's crocodiles in the sewer, and you cannot shoot a mugger. Alright, there's the Mercedes that I own. So... Okay, so you're out front of the... Yeah, I'm out front, I'm out front now. So there's that door, there's the window. Right. And to the other side is the cellar. But that's the wall right there. <laughs> it would go outside, like I said. Yeah, I, re I remember all this. Okay. Why do you have to take a taxi if you have a car? Do you really want to see what happens if you turn on the car? Does it explode? Yes. <laughs> And you know how I knew that? It wasn't because the first time I played it, I tried the car key. It was those uh, Nintendo Power, Nestor, and Howard comics. It was like, don't start the car. Yeah, and the car explodes. And they, they showed you what happened. They mentioned the crocodile in the sewer. And they mentioned the car exploding. So if you, if you put the key in the car, um, the car explodes and you die. But you have to... Apparently, if you open the hood, then uh, kaboom happens, too. Oh, come on! The oldest trick in the book, the old exploding car thing. <laughs> Are you serious? That old chestnut. Oh, you're a dick! At least it has, like, um, checkpoints. Oh my god, that was such a dick move. Alright, now, now. Hit the horn. I'm not, you know what, I'm not doing anything in the front seat. Hit the horn. I'm not hitting the horn. What if it, like, 
unlock something cool or something. No, it's gonna explode. If you hit the horn. Yes. <laughs> Alright, I wanna show you something. Now, let's just go down the list. Crocodiles in the sewer that you don't believe, right? Yeah. Uh, random muggers, a bar who has a cellar that should be in the street, yeah. an underground casino in the sewer, right? Uh huh. So, what else should go wrong, right? Let's see, I think it's this one. Yeah. So, how big would you say a Mercedes from the 50s are? Uh, or 60s? How, how oh, big? Kind of big. Kind of big? Ugh. I need the trunk lock. Can you open the trunk from the front seat? Uh, if you hit the horn. I'm not punching the horn. Alright, what we got here? What's this? Ignition. No, I'm not revving it up. There's that. There's that. Those are brakes. Why is it yelling at me? Because it'll explode. Alright, well, what's this crap I picked up? Let's take a look. Uh, snapshot. It's a snapshot of a 400 pound woman. Interesting. I want to look at her again. I'm a chubby chaser. <laughs> Not me, aces. It's a street map. Uh, Alright, we got the address to ace, follow this route. That way you'll know if you're being followed. Be careful, you don't want the cops to find Mrs. Sternwood in the trunk. Well, now we know it's in the trunk. But how do we open the trunk? Uh, ask Mrs. Sternwood to open it. Alright, we get... I'm not asking... <laughs> Mrs. <laughs> Mrs. Sternwood! I, 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 how do you get a 400... Hold on. How do you get a 400 pound woman in a Mercedes? Forklift. I don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> Alright. Now there's something here. Uh, use coin on newspaper boy. Well, he's very generous. Did you see that? Yeah. I was like, I just take a paper. I'm blind anyway. <laughs> yeah, right. Take the end paper. Why can't you spell? Oh, because you have to fit it up there. Yeah. She told them that she saw funny goings on. She gave a description. That fits you! You know what? You know what? I I have an idea. I'm going to... I want to be smart. Watch this. Watch this. I'm going to pull a... Um... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. I'm going to pull a, a Superman. I'm going to put sunglasses on. Let's screw you. know what? Screw you. I don't want to use them anyways. <laughs> Your diagnosis? Well, come on. With that face, Ben, you know he's on the level. Right? How much is 50 cents? Is it two coins? Yeah, two coins. There's like, there's, there's, we have two coins worth. Can you examine coin? Uh, fine. And be like, oh man, these are quarters. Because I don't, I don't know what coin it is. It's a quarter. Cool. All right. Now I know. Are you happy? Yeah. Do you feel happy. better? Do you feel better? Yeah. Okay. Use on... Joey's hitman has been looking for you. I got the word. He's waiting for you in his office. In your office. 
Is that the dead guy? No, because that's not our office. I just remembered. Pete's All Night Gun Palace. Okay, that does not look like All Night Gun Palace. That looks like Pete's All Night Gun Palace. It looks like three words, right? It looks like it should be like a strip club, not a gun palace. Yeah, right? The door is already open. I, I noticed that. Okay. $20 for a gun. It's awesome. Now what's funny is you can buy the gun and shoot him. The police show up, but... I think we figured out what the $20 bill's for, right? Probably. Yeah, you know, use it on your fat belly. Take what? What is up with people just like giving me stuff? Oh, no, nah, they didn't take so, okay. So now we need bullets. But I got one He said, bullet. take what you want. And then he was like, but you have to give me a $20 still. Yeah, it's, I don't know. Alright, so we need, we need bullets. Let's take these these bullets are a quarter each. That's kind of expensive, isn't it? I think so. Yeah, I think so too. So we'll just take six bullets. Right? Yeah. Oh I see, that's how he gets his money. He charges cheap for the gun. It's like it's like um, the mock razors. <laughs> you give them away and people it was it you give it to them for free make them pay for the um, the blades so I'm gonna use my bullets on my gun oh. those bullets are probably for your gun you dick because you just bought gun three and you already had gun one those are bullet one so I'm thinking let's go together. Oh, well, that's just a waste of my money. <laughs> but it's weird that he was selling guns we didn't surrounded by bullet ones. Yeah, <laughs> what is gun three? Nothing in the wastebasket, so let's go over here. Now shoot him in the face. I can't! Because I think if I shoot... Wait. Alright, here's Pandora. Now, there's two taxi cabs. I don't know if there's a difference. But we'll use this one. One of them's driven by a hitman that will just kill you. Probably. You're in a yellow cab. The cabbie looks like a nice guy. That means he's not a nice guy. No, so we're going to... Oh, we can speak to these people. I didn't see the speak option. Where do you want to go, mister? Well, we're on Perora Street now. Sherman is the doctor's office, right? And then West End is what? I don't know. Let's go to West End. Three quarters. That's pretty cheap. It's not bad. You know, the gun owner just reached in my hand and took my money. Why can't you do it? <laughs> Thanks for the fare, Mac. Your name's not Mac. It's Ace Harding. Ah, uh, you know what? Where's that, um... Where's that card? All right, we use the card on here, and then use the card on here. And I'm going 
to hit. A mirror! God dang it! Oh, wait a second. <laughs> That's all you wanted to do. <laughs> Alright, um, examine. If it's a photograph of a stout looking brunette, we found an address. Ben, would you like to meet a stout looking brunette? I don't know. We'll take the photo. I can't take it. We will examine the magazine. Take the sofa. Oh, damn it, I pushed the cancel button. Come here, come here, me, 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 me. Damn it! Stop pressing B, this isn't Mario. See, I can't take the sofa. Take down. the magazine. Yeah. <laughs> take all those books. Okay. Should be able to take them. Alright, so the whole purpose of this place was just to get the address. That was pointless. Can you uh, move the photo that's on the wall? It seems like there should be something behind it. You wanna try? If you're in like a fancy place, uh, I'd, I'd put a safe behind the photo. Maybe I could hit it. No. Damn it. Maybe I could speak to it? No, you can't move. Oh, open, maybe. No, game just yells at you. Okay. Alright, I'm going to leave this hotel and then I will let you play some more. Alright, uh... Okay, so... I know if you choose the blue guy, he yells at you a lot. So let's go to Kinsey's house. 75 cents. What if you go somewhere and you start running out of money? Uh, I think we could just go back and play the... Um, yeah, but what if you're not near the... Like, like well, if I'm here and I run out of cash? Yeah. Uh, game over? <laughs> we better go back to the casino. Don't have any keys now. So we gotta go back. Alright, you play. Your turn. I don't want to take all the fun. Let's see here. Which one was the one we just went? We went to West End, right? Yeah. Let's go to Sherman. That's the doctor's office. So, I'm guessing everywhere in this world is just 75 cents, right? Seems like it. Not bad. I should just automatically deduct it. Because yeah, it's, it's tedious. You see, if we were playing this on the computer where we could drag a mouse, we would be done so quickly. It's not open. Stop being so tedious. That's the hitman. Shoot him. Do I just shoot them through the glass? Yes. I do remember this. If I open it, I'll probably die, right? Yes, you will. So I don't want to do that. 
Okay, uh, Game Facts states that you can never run out of coins as long as you get to the bar. So after this, let's go back to the bar and gamble some more. What do you mean you never run out of coins as long as you get to the bar? Alright, so if we get to the casino, there's always going to be one quarter in the slot machine. So we can keep playing it to get more money. But if we run out of money while we're here, we're SOL. It says that? Like, yeah. you'll just... That's it. That's it. Ben, you're going to commit a cold-blooded murder. I know. What if it's like a nice stout woman or something? Like that? <laughs> the, the stout brunette. Boom! Headshot. Uh, okay. Boom! Headshot. Headshot. <laughs> now I need to get like a new window for my office. Yeah. What yeah. An asshole. Yeah. Now it just says Ace Hang. Uh, is it locked? Is... He got in. It can't be locked. Oh my god. Ow, I just hit my head on the wall. I thought this key was for the office. I guess that was the office at the bar? With the word office. Bar Scott. office, not our office. What's key two again? That's the Mercedes, isn't it? Yeah. Um. Crap. I guess we gotta go back to the bar. Go back to the bar, man. Yeah. I'm gonna go over here first. Yeah, what's in the office? Ah, all right. We got the oh, we got the doctor's office. Okay. God dang it! Do we have any key? Any other keys? This key might work. That's the office to the bar. We've already figured that out. Ah. Uh. Fine. Uh, what else do we have in our inventory? Hold on, go through our inventory first. Nothing cool. No, go right, go right. One more. Coat, gun, card, key, seltzer. I have a medic with me. That's medicine. Um, <laughs> medic, you got the Team Fortress medic with you. Uh, Ben, go open your coat, examine the lighter and the hanky. Because we haven't examined those two items yet. I'm just gonna take all this out. But you know it's gonna just be like, oh well that lighter is obviously a lighter. It's used to make fire. If it does something that smart ass, I'm gonna laugh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's uh, let's make a second clip of these things so we don't lose any data. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna be right 